Welcome to the Hologram News Network, your trusted source of Star Atlas news. Major announcement today is Automata, the developer of Grand Strategy's space MMO Star Atlas, announced a 73% layoff of its workforce. Now we'll go through the entire announcement, but here are the key takeaways that you need to know from yesterday's news. Number one, approximately 122 people were let go, or roughly 73% of Automata's workforce. This includes Spearsoft, who are developing the UE5 immersive world experience of Star Atlas. All that remains are 45 team members of the Star Atlas development team. Now this brings us to our second point, in which UE5 development is on an extended timeline. The Marketplace, DAO, and Faction Fleet, and Faction Claims will be maintained at a lower priority. Sage and the mobile app that was announced at Solana Play GG are now the new focus. Point number three, each of the founders, including Michael Wagner, have taken a significant pay cut after this workforce reduction. Now, they didn't release the exact numbers in the announcement, but a quick Google of Florida state laws indicates that the minimum requirement to maintain legal status on non-hourly wages is approximately $36,000 per year. That's right, Michael Wagner could have taken a pay cut reduction to as low as $36,000 per year per state regulations. Now lastly, and probably the point that is least talked about currently, is that the runway has been extended by another year. Now, this is not due to any cash injections from external venture capital firms or any conditions that any venture capital firm has levied against Automata, but rather just a reduction in operating expenses that the team has taken. By reducing its workforce, Automata is no longer expending multiple millions of dollars per month and likely has reduced that expense to less than a million dollars in a single 30-day period. Now, this should come as no surprise to anyone who's been following Star Atlas, but let's take a look as to the why this is happening now. Following FTX's collapse last year, it became evident that Star Atlas needed venture capital outside investment in order to continue development into the latter half of 2023 and into 2024. For the first half of 2023, Automata was engaged in serious discussions with several venture capital firms. However, none of them were able to reach an agreement with Automata. That brings us here today. Let's take a look at the announcement now from Star Atlas. Star Atlas is no longer in a financial position to wait for a new deal to be finalized. We must take immediate action to reduce our team size and project scope to preserve our, oper to preserve our operational runway. In the immediate term, Thomas's focus is going to be delivering Sage and the Crew Companion mobile app. While we are able to continue development of our Unreal Engine 5 product, under this strategy, it will be with a reduced scope and delayed timeline. To demonstrate our commitment to the team and to being in this together, each of the founders will be reducing their fixed compensation by a material amount. These changes are intended to preserve our operational weight for up to another year and beyond. Now, all this can be found on page four of Star Atlas in public announcement. Going to page five, we can see what Automata plans for the future. The specific impacts on our existing and planned product line are as follows. Sage and the mobile crew companion app will receive prioritized attention for new feature development. Existing products like the Galactic Marketplace, the DAO, Faction Fleet, and Faction Claims will continue to be maintained and developed. Our Unreal Engine 5 product will continue to be developed with the goal of launching the recently announced massively multiplayer tests with Metagravity, but further new feature development on the showroom will be on a significantly extended timeline. Now this is pretty grim news for any fans of the UE5 showroom, and many players were hopeful for a UE5 experience either later this year or next. Now there have been questions on whether or not the extended timeline and extended runway given the budget cuts will allow future UE5 development. However, it appears that the scope and size of the UE5 playable environment will be reduced until Automata can find additional external funding. Now Wagner concludes the six page announcement in a letter directly to his team. We'll take a moment here to read through that. To those of you who are leading the team, please know that we will always value and respect your talent and efforts. Unfortunate circumstances brought us here, and this is not your fault. Thank you, from the bottom of my heart, for your contributions and everything you have done to build Star Atlas. You will always be a part of the Star Atlas journey. To our remaining team, these are challenging times, but the future holds a lot of promise. We have products in the pipeline that we know are better designed and better built than any other Web3 game out there. 
we are set to amaze the entire space. We have the capabilities and now the runway to deliver those products. We have developed industry-leading on-chain gaming technology, and we will always have the ability to turn on AAA quality production engine bag on the moment that we can expand our development scope once again. To the Star Atlas community, you have always been outstanding, active, and inspiring. Many of you not only play Startless games, but also build them from the ground up by yourselves. We remain as dedicated as ever to empowering you to keep building as we will all travel this journey together. And finally, stay tuned. We retain just as much passion and vigor as ever and maintain resolve to fulfill this dream. Our mission remains the same. Michael Wagner. Michael Wagner will be hosting an AMA tomorrow, July 26th at 1 p.m. Eastern in the Star Atlas Discord. We'll also be live streaming that AMA on our YouTube channel. So be sure to tune in and don't miss all of the questions that will get asked by the community to Michael Wagner. Automata also plans to unveil its strategy for the remaining year and product launches and product releases going forward. If you're looking for the full six page announcement from Star Atlas, you can find that both in our Medium articles and in the Star Atlas Discord. We'll be back with another video after the Star Atlas AMA tomorrow to cover the future of Star Atlas. This concludes our coverage of Star Atlas's recent announcement. I'm Kriggs. Commanders, stay safe and Godspeed.